this morning, Cornell University police need your help to find a first-year student reported missing by his parents. 18-year-old Sean West, he was last seen in his residence hall on Tuesday morning, April 6th. He hasn't been seen since. Sean is 5'11", weighs 160 pounds with black hair and brown eyes. There's no word on what he might have been wearing at the time of his disappearance, but if you've seen him, if you know where he is, look at your screen. It's Sean West. You're asked to please call Cornell University Police. The number is 607-255-1111. Police agencies are on the lookout for this man for much different reasons. 32-year-old Matthew Perry is considered armed, dangerous, and suicidal. He's wanted on criminal contempt and may be driving a white 2016 Hyundai Sonata. He was last seen in Tioga County. Police are encouraging anyone who sees him or knows where Perry is to call 911. Syracuse University just announced it's making the COVID-19 vaccine mandatory for all new and returning students, faculty, and staff. SU joins two other Central New York colleges who made the same call. That's Ithaca College and Cornell University. Both of them recently decided to make the vaccine a requirement for the upcoming fall semester. All right, this one's just a heads up. If you got your first COVID vaccine dose at the Shopping Town Mall drive through clinic last month, because of the chance now for rain early next week, next Monday's and Tuesday's second shot clinics will be held at the On Center in downtown Syracuse. Again, these clinics are on Monday, April 12th, and Tuesday the 13th for second doses if you got your first one at Shopping Town. Onondaga County is continuing to see a spike in cases. The county executive says there's a few reasons why, one of them being the UK strain of the virus is now the dominant variant in the US. Another reason, nearly 80% of cases here are in people under 40 years of age. 10% of new cases are also coming from travel.